Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, maybe I'll try that, honestly. Um, it's not a terrible idea. And I'm certainly not opposed to doing, uh, like, baby strats. <laughs> when I started running all skills, I actually got... Uh, I routed it in Lantern, actually. <laughs> I just, like, got a million artifacts and sold them to Lem and got Lantern before going into Crystal Peak. So I did not feel like learning Dark Rooms. Like, I wanted to just, like, do runs and actually complete runs. I mean, yes, you're you're not wrong. But like, if if I find that QGA is awful, then I, I, I will just start doing the other route. Like I'm sort of just, yeah, doing it as an experiment, I guess. So my early game and my last one was also terrible, even though, like, I do it in all skills. <laughs> like, I got a 406 Ventral Spirit, which is pretty slow. But, anyways. <laughs> Are you saying bad things about my horizontal splits? <laughs> I guess I, I personally just like the uh, having less detail, I guess. Hi, Elderbug. Bye, Elderbug. Um, like, yeah, whether horizontal or vertical, I like just having, like, uh, less detail. Like, I'm not a big fan of, like, seeing all the graphs and all the random comparison numbers and stuff. I just feel like it doesn't really add a whole lot. That's just my opinion. <laughs> okay, are we gonna just die? That's cool, I guess. I just... okay. This is fine. It, uh, I don't know if I need all this Geo, but let's grab it. Let's also heal a little bit, why not? This early game's going about as well as last time. Ow. Oh my god! I know how to do early game, I swear. As soon as you switch to vertical, you got a recce. I'm sure that's why, right? It's, it's all the all in the splits. the Aspect Arena, this was- well, okay, no, it still was really bad. <laughs> Let's be honest, I took like 7 damage. But we didn't die, so that's okay.
Ah, uh, yes, the 405 gold. The classic. Oh, I forgot to switch to Chinese again. <laughs> Dang it! I mean, again, it doesn't really matter. It's not like I'm going to be getting a meaningful PB right now, but... I did mean to switch the language. Yeah, time save for next run. You're exactly right. I shouldn't jump. Okay. <laughs> I don't have dash yet. First one run was in French in 59. Yeah, that's how that works. Get hit. Whenever he throws a second one, I always mess that up and take a hit there. Yeah, let's do this thing. Eh, okay, whatever. <laughs> or not. Yeah, for some reason, the second ball there, I just, like, screw up the timing and it will always, always get hit by it. But hey, we got some extra soul, I guess. I mean, sure, whatever, let's heal. <laughs> oh, wow, okay. Well, regret. <laughs> uh, so I guess I'm just not doing the skip in this next room. I'll just do the pogo instead. I was about to say, that strat is much swaggier, in my opinion, than the fireball skip anyways, but uh, less so when you just, like, fly past the, <laughs> the, the husk and don't even hit him. The Lad Lift? That's a really nice name. I've never heard that heard it called that before, but that is a really sweet uh, <laughs> name for it. Yeah, one fireball skip for swag strats. Okay, let's see if we can do this. Okay. Not quite right, but good enough. I guess I have enough Geo, right? We just need like 220. Okay, okay I'm doing this real, executing this really expertly right now. And by really expertly, I mean. Okay. 
The second half of that was like not too bad. Yeah, doing hard at one quickly is not not a trivial thing, is it? Mass quitouts for some reason. Half a second time save. Now we have to PB. I almost fell in the acid there by just dashing too late. Explosion Pogo, I can completely embarrass myself by failing this Pogo. Just how that works. Oh, or not. Okay, sweet. Okay, let us go to Salubas. No, I didn't do the mouse quit out. Well, that's awkward. Well, now we can't PP, I guess. I'm gonna have to get used to remembering how to do that if I plan on actually doing that. <laughs> yeah, I would not blame you if you just left the stream. No. No. Um, kind of supposed to go up on this platform, aren't I? Okay, we do need King Stations. Let's get that. And by King Station, I mean Forgotten Crossroads. I mean, we are also going to need King Station. That is a fact, but... Uh, Not really relevant at this moment in time, I guess. Thanks for staying low, Chris Mother. I appreciate it. Holy cow, I actually got everything. The time save miracle. Fly really, really slowly. Oh. 
No, don't shoot fireballs at me. What a jerk. Uh, okay. That almost got sketchy for a second. Yeah, how long is all term notches? It's like close to, uh, it's like a little under an hour, right? I think. That's no, 52, wow. I'm kind of surprised it's faster than all skills. Actually, I would have thought. Uh... Yeah, I mean, I guess I knew it was like around an hour, but. Oh man, I can save so much time here. I fell off the dream platforms twice in my last run. <laughs> How did I how did I save 30 seconds on stream now? Of course I still don't know how to do this movement, but I'm supposed to go under that, okay, that's fine. Really? I only saved like 10 seconds there? I fell twice? Assumed it would have been more time than that, but okay. Uh, okay, I just pressed the C dash button instead of the dash button, so I guess I deserve that. <laughs> Okay, so we're going to city, we're getting the whatever, it's not the seal, but the the other artifacts from this room here. So what do I need to kill like any enemies in city? I know I kill the- there's like the row of enemies like in front of the artifact that I'm gonna kill because they're just sort of there. I was supposed to hit that elevator switch also. This row of guys, but like do I actually need to do anything else really? Eh, like I don't need to kill like these guys, right? I don't think. Yeah, okay. Um, need to go to King Station though, right? Don't I? I suppose picking up the extra, if I'm gonna get the extra, the nail upgrade, you're gonna end up with a bunch of extra Geo anyways, because it costs, like, 400 to upgrade your nail, and the relic is 450, I think. So I'd be over even more than that. Oh, it's two feet. Okay, yeah, so I don't need to care about Geo at all then. So I go, I, I go up to Spire Bench and then go down to uh, Nail Upgrade, right? And save quit. I believe that's how that works. Sounds right to me. Uh, so no, I still want to do this first, though. I guess, and then back up and then over. Sounds right, I guess.
Oh man, and then this way I can bench and it's actually like optimal and not just being a coward. Yeah, it's all come together. I need to open that then. Or wait, I don't even need to go this way, do I? I suppose I could have just gone... In fact, yeah, you're not supposed to go this way. I'm supposed to go across the... the down road. There's no sense in coming up. I, th I think? I think that's how you're supposed to do it? I don't know. Probably doesn't matter hugely either way, but... I think you're supposed to get the bench and then come back down and go horizontally across the across the fountain. Uh, I don't need to sell the lead now. Um, I do want that up, I guess, right? Ah, jeez, I'm confused. <laughs> oh, I need to go for Celia, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep. You always want, um, oh yeah, I guess you're right. You, you would always want elevator down, wouldn't you? Because you can just go down either way. Um, okay. This on-the-fly routing. Ah. Uh. Are there enemies I need to worry about right now? Should I heal? I mean, I'm going to heal. I just need to stop and actually... Find some room. We're just not going to talk about any of this movement. I mean, I don't regularly come over here. I don't know how to do it. <laughs> it's fine. That was a good pogo. I like that. Hmm. Ah, Ranjo Stenja. 250. It's a steal. And getting the nail upgrade also means more mouse quid outs, so that's, you know, another plus. Okay. Now, do, the real question is, do I lower this elevator? I think I will still. <laughs> it's, like, it's like gambling. It's like, am I going to screw this up? If so, save a tiny amount of time. If not, don't save a tiny amount of time. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm lowering it because I'm scared I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to die in Watcher Nights. Did you swing your nail at me? Wow. Yeah, you really do kill these a lot faster with nail off the say. I knew he was going to bounce into me. Oh, jeez. Okay, well, this was going well. Let's heal. Let's heal again. Back to heal twice. Why not? And then just take more damage. 
Yeah, it's a it's a big upgrade, right? You go from five to like nine. And you actually do use your nail like a lot against these things, so. Oh jeez. Oh no. Plus side, we lowered the elevator, so I am gonna save a couple seconds. Time save. Did I just forget to use Dream now? Like I said, did I? Eh. We wouldn't want to make things too easy, I guess. Yeah, 100 HP sounds right, I think. be reading chat about devout strategy killing while <laughs> fighting Watcher Knights. Ah, too fine. Assuming I know how to do the damage tank strats. Now. Okay, okay. Yo. Okay, I'm gonna just get this first. But now I lowered the elevator, so now I am gonna lose time on them while leaving. I hate to see it. Clearly, it's optimal to lower the elevator for the first fight and then keep it up for the second fight. That's how that works. Um, uh, yeah. <laughs> nope. Don't let go of the button. What? Uh, yeah, it probably does help a lot against Yumu too, doesn't it? Yeah. Not that I'm super worried about either of those fights, but yeah, it's it's nice, right? For sure. Ugh, let's stretch. Yeah, like, optimally, the, the nail upgrade doesn't lose that much time. It's only, like, 30 seconds or something, right? Because you do save a bunch of time uh, on a bunch of bosses, right? Right, I don't have C-dash. <laughs> Uh. 
Um, okay, so I don't need to bench anywhere, except, well, I need to bench in Dermouth, not here, though. Uh, I'm just going the wrong way again. <laughs> I guess I can go just down this way, can't I? This is fine. Yeah. Yeah, I can't go this way. Is it faster to go the other way? I guess. Yeah. <laughs> or can you not come this way? Unless you... Right, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. Right, because there's a gate here. Yeah, yeah. That makes sense. So yeah, this way it probably is faster if that gate is open, but it's, it's not typically open. Okay. And it's it's not even typically open even with nail one. I just like accidentally came down here and opened it, right? Because normally I wouldn't even come down to this stage. Or I guess you could, I don't know. Maybe it's actually worth. Yeah, well, I nail upgrade, right? Extra seal. Jira different in one two two one. Okay, so we're going to dirt mouth for lantern. No, oh, just tighter. All right, fair enough. Well, one two two one runner should just get nail one, and that would solve their problem. It's bench here. Okay, benched. It's fine. Why is this room so cursed? I would not have thought, coming from all skills, that this would be the room that's like... <laughs> that's stupidly hard and like, really obnoxious. Um, okay, I need to... figure out how like, look down works there. <laughs> Probably learn the damage tank in this room, but we'll just do it this way. Or not. Uh, okay. Or we could just do the damage tank as well. That's fine too. Just heal? Like, I don't know. I guess it doesn't really matter. I'm so used to, like, 
all skills where you don't just save quit out of, out of here, and so there's still a lot of, like, really dangerous like, parts of Sea Peaks to do after this. But you can really just, like, tank a bunch of damage and it's fine. No underplot, though. QGA is one thing, but underplot. No, no, no. No, no. Let's be serious here. Like, whenever I see any, whenever I watch anyone doing any percents, they're always doing this room with, like, one health, and I'm freaking out, but, again, I'm just used to all skills where you have to do the dark room immediately afterwards. Ow. How rude. Uh, let's leave the room. <laughs> Oops. Yeah, I exclusively do the damage cycle in, like, all skills, but in any percent, I guess I'm not opposed to just doing the damage. Uh, I guess I'm just gonna bench in, uh, Teacher's Archives or whatever. Oops. Okay, well, let's, just, let's just do this a little carefully. I'm not sure I needed that soul. It looks like I don't actually. Yeah, I've considered doing a like, or like, I like thought about doing uh, something like a Shade Soul round as well. Because yeah, it probably doesn't lose too much time and it probably makes it real comfy. But yeah, it's probably a lot easier on 221. I wasn't counting them. Oh, okay. Um. That was weird. much worse than, than my previous attempt or than my previous run even with the, the nail upgrade no idea how close they are <laughs> let's heal Two two runners really do have it too easy. It's true. Here I am dealing with like back rolling water knights. 
They're sitting there getting their dash slash and their fluke nest. Their wall plank storage. Okay, let's see if we can do the, uh, the fabled QGA again. Let's go. I should be sea dashing. <laughs> uh, I probably shouldn't be canceling that sea dash either. I don't want to heal. I'm just going to heal. <laughs> Let's heal. Saved. Oh, man. Uh, I don't have soul for this. Okay. You know, I would really appreciate it if you would come on down here. Maybe I should just... Level 1 nail probably helping a lot there, actually. <laughs> Could you move? Thank you. I know, I'm killing these things too fast now. I can't get, gather as much soul. Can't make that jump. <laughs> that was actually quite a good clean Queen's Gardens. Didn't take a million damage. That's a cool little strat, like going into that wall and falling quicker. I don't really know how it works, but it looks sweet. Okay. See you later. Thanks for stopping by and have a good uh, rest of your day, Vex.
issues. I'm like extremely paranoid about falling here. <laughs> that wings this seems like really sketchy. It's really not that sketchy, but feels that way. Help, I'm stuck. Yeah. I've never done it in, in all skills, because obviously you have wings. Although I'm just still like sort of scared of doing it in all skills too, but yeah, in any percent it seems much more <laughs> cursed. But then a lot of things in all in any percent seem cursed, so <laughs> So this is only three nail hits. So I can actually do like nail fireball here. That's cool. Oh, you kill these in two nail hits? Oh, that's so comfy. <laughs> oh, that's so good. Holy cow. That one is great. Okay, I'll just die to, die to that, I guess. Uh, am I doing this with one HP? Sure, I guess. Cowarding my way out of that. I really did that to the wall. Okay, it's fine. I think I've said this before, but yeah, I'm really glad that these cutscenes are unskippable on like one two two one. It's a nice, uh, nice little stretch break. All right, now we do our boring cycloneless movements. Go the wrong way. Oops, dash off the wall. So you're supposed to like pause here and unpause, so that gives you control and that saves time? Question mark. Probably very little, right? It's like not like the hard fall eats that much, but you don't have nail arts, you do what you can, I guess. Okay, so let's see how nail one THK goes. I 
pretty good at dodging them uh, as parries. I used to think those were just like straight up impossible to dodge, but they're, it's actually, it is possible. As it turns out, who knew? Oh. Ah, second screen. That was, yeah, his first screen was really late, I thought. I was kind of surprised, but yeah. There's the second screen, so. Completely missed every single nail swing there. Sir, please come out of the corner. Thank you. Oh wow, yeah, this is a lot faster, isn't it? Now I have fake golds everywhere. <laughs> Is it really worth the comfiness for fake golds? When I eventually switch back? These are the important questions. I suppose I could. <laughs> it's probably a fair point. Yeah, that was quite good. Can't complain about that at all. Sub 50, I guess. <laughs> Ugh, 